Hello, welcome to Fame's online YouTube tutorial series. Fame is a fine art and performing art academy serving adults with intellectual and developmental disabilities. We are based in Portland, Oregon, and we're very happy that you found us online. So remember, these classes are for everybody, all abilities, all skill level, and this one, Everybody Dance, I will be your teacher, Michael Galen, and you will first need to make sure that you have enough room wherever you are to be able to put your arms out straight side to side and to be able to take about two steps in any direction. Beyond that, feel free to modify the movement as you need or as you would like for your body. Uh, whether that means sitting and making adjustments to do it while seated or only doing it part of the way instead of the full movement. So do what feels best for your body. Please feel free to pause the video if you would like to go a little slower to repeat something or to get some water. All right, thank you very much. Again, my name is Michael Galen. This is Everybody Dance. Hey, Fame Academy, what's up? We are back with another episode of Everybody Dance. Today, we are actually going to be continuing building on the content that we did the last episode, which was published, I believe, May 1st. So if you have not watched that one, go check that out before watching this because we're going to build on what we did. So we learned a move called the Tone Wop. And today we're going to do some variations. We're going to do some of the upper body variations and movements that you can do if you're seated or if you're standing. And then we'll do some more of the feet variations for those standing. All right, so here we go. All right, to warm up, we're going to roll our shoulders to the back eight times. Elbows eight times. Full arms eight times. Then the same thing forward. All right, do what you can with your body and with your range of motion. We're just getting warm and loose. Here we go. Right, getting our shoulders and our arms warm. Now we're just going to do a little bit of neck isolation, some side to side, tilts, up, down, roll it around. All right, here we go, nice and gentle. Now we're gonna warm up our hips, so we're gonna do squats. So make sure your feet are a little bit wider than your hips. Knees and toes are both pointed in the same direction, a little out to the sides. And try and keep your back as upright as possible as you're squatting down. So not bending forward like this. Try and keep your back as up as possible.
All right, now we're gonna do our heel toes with the ankles. So heel goes out, toe goes out, heel goes out, toe goes out, and reverse other side. All right, then we'll do both sides. So let's real quick warm up our tone wop from last episode and review it. Remember the rhythm is one, two, three, you go step out in with your heels. So remember it's that heel click. I'll demonstrate. We go step out in, step out in. So it goes one, two, three, four, step out in, step out in. Boom, pop, boom, pop. If you hear the snare drum in the music, that high pitched drum goes pop, that's when your heels are coming together. All right, let's practice to the music. That's our toe wop. Now let's talk about the arms. We didn't really talk about it last time. So first, you'll notice that my arms, when my heels went out in, my arms were going out in. Really the elbows is where I'm thinking, reaching out, pulling in. So I go step, reach, pull, boom. So when those elbows straighten, go out, my heels are also out, boom. Almost like there's strings attached to my legs. So that's number one, out in. Number two with the arms is you can think of there's two doors, one on either side of you and you're turning the doorknobs. So you're grabbing them and turning them behind you. So that's happening as you reach out and pull your arms in. So you go step out, turn the doorknobs in. Step, grab the doors, open them. 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 So you grab the door, kind of your palm will face behind you so that you can turn the doorknob as you open it. Let's practice the music. Very good, very good. That was half speed. You'll notice at the end that I went to my arms in front, opened the door in front of me almost, and pulled it in. So this arm movement out in with that turning of the doorknob, that can happen in any direction. There are doors everywhere, just really waiting for you to open them, all right? So let's just put the music on. I'll do different directions. You don't have to do the same ones I do. You can reach any direction, all right? We'll do it slow and then fast.
how'd that go? I hope it went well. Hope you're learning now to experiment with your arms in the tone wop, just opening those doors of possibilities all around you. All right, so now that we've worked on the arms, let's work on the legs. So far, we're just stepping in place, heels out in. But you don't have to step just in place. You can step forward or step back. So here's what I mean. If you're gonna step forward, now instead of doing a heel click, you could do that, but we're gonna do just a twist. Like everyone's doing the twists, all right? So you're gonna step forward. Both heels are gonna be up off the ground. So you're on the ball of your feet, you're just twist your hips, boom, boom. Step the other foot, twist, twist. Other foot, twist, twist. Other foot, boom, boom. Yeah, boom, boom. Boom, boom. Step, twist, twist. Put the arms, open those doors. Ha, ha. Boom, boom. Don't forget about our bounce. Always grooving and bouncing in all these videos. Let's try it with the music. So that is our tone wop variations to the front. We were doing one in between right in place so that we could switch sides. So play with that, have fun. You can also do it to the back. I'll let you experiment and learn that one. All right, see you in the next episode with Everybody Dance.